Hey guys, today I am back on Minecraft. Last video, I finished my house, wow. and today I'm going to be finishing my farm, and hopefully I'm going to be able to get some iron. As always, like and subscribe if you guys are new. Sit back and enjoy. Alright guys, the first thing I want to do is actually head over here and check out this cave that I found. I found this uh, off stream, or off recording I guess, but I want to go down here. I don't know how deep this goes, I just saw a waterfall like go deep, and we're going to see how far it goes, so... This, this may be a stupid idea, but I don't really care. Oh my gosh, this, this goes so much deeper than I thought it did. Dude. I need to find iron, though. I need to get, like, iron and coal. I also just broke my legs. What is this kind of rock? Oh, something's hitting me. Dude, what? Okay, we're back down here. To pick up all my stuff, because I guess there was a skeleton down here that I didn't even see. And, uh, yeah, it killed me. I got killed by a skeleton. But good thing it is actually hardcore mode. And I lied to you guys in the first episode. Because there isn't a hardcore mode in this. It's a whole different thing. And, uh, yeah, I'm just on the hardest difficulty of Survivor. It's, it's, I'm not on hardcore mode, by the way, guys. So, yeah, I, I lied and I didn't even realize. So I apologize. But we're still going to continue this because I like this world. So, I found some iron here. I'm going to grab it. Not a whole lot, but... Any iron at this point is I'll take it because I need anything that I can get. I have none. I also kind of need coal, but it is what it is. I'll get this iron, get everything I can now. I really don't want to be down here for too long because I already died when I was down here. So I don't really want to do that again. It wasn't fun because then I have to go find all my stuff again. And yeah, it's, it's just not a good idea. It's not fun. So let me grab this iron real quick. And I think I'm going to head back to the top. I'm going to go. I'm, I'm just going to check, make sure that there's nothing else down here. But I think I'm just going to head to the top soon here. After I just double check. Make sure I get as much as I can. And just be as efficient as possible. Because I don't want to die. And I don't also don't really want to explore this cave completely right now. Because now is just not the time to do it. Right now I just need to focus on getting a few things. Alright guys we're back. Oh my gosh. We're back up here at my house. Uh, I was able to cook some iron. And I got some shears out of it. Because I also want to make sure that I'm working with my... Uh, sheep that I'm gonna get and pigs and cows like this farm is gonna be more than just chickens. I promise also What is this chicken? Okay, he walked right back in anyways, but how did that chicken do that anyways? Like he literally just walked through my fence Okay, let me grab these eggs. I'm gonna throw them probably I can save them and start like making cakes I know I can do that. Let me try to get as much chicken as possible too. I can't forget to do that but anyways Yeah I need to be able to use my eggs for something. Right now, I'm just collecting them, honestly, and it's kind of weird. But I do want to add cows and sheep and pigs to my farm eventually. I also have a, um, what are these called? Sugar cane. I have sugar cane farm coming. So as you can see, I'm, I'm collecting some sugar cane. Not really for any use, but I mean, eventually I got to use it for enchantment tables and stuff. And I'll get I'll get to that point, but right now I'm just collecting like a whole lot. I don't know why, but is what it is. I do want to build my farm over here. I think I'm gonna use that water that is already there to build my farm, because, or not my farm necessarily, like my planting. I'm gonna plant my like seeds and stuff over here, so I'm not gonna have to get water bucket and like do all that. I'm just gonna be able to go right here, put put dirt under like one block of water so then i'm just like using what i already have instead of having to like do all that extra work i'll show you guys it, it'll be really simple it, it'll make all sense it'll all make sense once you see it all right i'm crafting a shovel now so then i can uh go out and get some dirt because i'm gonna have to clear up a lot of area i'm gonna have to collect a lot of dirt so i can build my farm because i don't have a whole lot now so i need it Alright, so now that we have the dirt, now we just have to actually build the farm. We have enough dirt, we're going to be able to do it pretty easily. Let's get to it.
All right, guys, so there is the farm. That is the farm completely done now. For now, obviously, I'm going to eventually, like, expand on it and make it look better. But that's what it looks like as of right now. And I do have to actually go get food. I have literally, like, no food, and my bar is all the way down to three. So let's hurry up, get out there, kill some animals, get some food, maybe even get some apples from trees. I don't know. Alright, so now that we got some food, I actually want to come over here and check on my sugarcane farm. It kind of looks like really uneven. I want to fix that real quick, make it look like actually half decent instead of look like this, because it looks bad right now. So I'm going to hurry up and quickly do this real quick. It shouldn't take too long. I, I wouldn't imagine, because it's, it's literally just sugarcane. It's not going to be anything too difficult. But for now, once I get this done, I'm going to have a pretty solid sized sugarcane farm actually. And that should be good enough for when I go to, like, get books and stuff, when I have to build, like, libraries and whatever, so I can get the enchantments. You guys know how Minecraft works. I shouldn't have to teach you guys how Minecraft works. You guys know how it works. So, let me hurry up and get this done just real quick. Alright guys, so after searching a little bit, I was able to get one sheep and a few cows easily because I got wheat because you guys, you know, you know, placing seeds, getting wheat, essential to finding cows and essential to getting sheep. We were able to do that pretty easily. I also fixed this up. You probably saw that when it was sped up, but uh, I was able to fix that up. I do want to clear out these and make it so my windows are like, so I have see through like ceiling kind of. I think it looks really cool that way. You guys let me know if that looks cool to you guys uh, or what else or some other ideas I should add into this like in my house into my farm you guys know whatever you guys want any like ideas or anything for what I should do please just let me know and I'm down to do them as long as they I, as long as I agree with them because I don't want to do something stupid obviously like build a giant watermelon actually that wouldn't be that stupid that would be kind of cool but anyways like I was saying any ideas any suggestions you guys have that i should add to my world let me know and i will definitely do it or at least try to do it so yeah as long as there's as long as it's reasonable as long as it makes sense but from here from my house i have all these windows i can see my farm i can see the pretty much the weather completely like if it's raining i'll be able to know because the ceiling i can see straight through it so it's really cool i wouldn't suggest it in real life probably but in minecraft it looks cool so now we're, we're really starting to collect sugarcane a lot. I'm not too like worried on getting sugarcane, but my my farm is like getting pretty big, so it, it's just gonna happen, I guess. My actual farm with my seeds are looking good. Once this wheat, like once this wheat is completely grown, we're gonna get a whole bunch of wheat. We're gonna be able to like blow up our farm, our sheep and uh, cow farm. It's gonna it's gonna be amazing. So you just gotta stick and wait around. It takes some time, obviously, but. It's getting there, and I also don't know what I'm going to do with that last pen. Probably the pigs will go in there, because I think I'm just going to keep the sheep and the cows together. Just because they all are so attracted to wheat, they're going to all follow me whenever I'm walking around with it. Alright guys, so the very last thing I'm going to do in this video is I'm actually going to go get some more wood. I'm kind of running low on it, so I'm going to go do that real quick, and then I'm probably going to end off the video because... This recording has taken, uh, it's taken me about an hour and a half right now as of recording. I'll probably cut it down to like 15 minutes for you guys, like 15, 20 minutes. But for me, it's been like an hour and a half and, uh, Now I'm actually going to be going through and changing the foundation of my house. Like, it's completely made of sand, or not sand, but dirt. And I, I want to make it all wood so then it doesn't like look like that. I don't really like the way it looks when it's like the bottom row is all dirt around and then everything above is wood. So I'm going to go ahead, fix that up, and I'm pretty sure I got it all now. And that's the last thing I'm going to be doing. 
All right, guys, now I'm not sure exactly how long this video is going to end up being because I do have to edit it and cut it down, but it took me about an hour and a half to make. So I take my time and I do enjoy making these videos for you guys. So if you guys do enjoy them, please hit that subscribe button. About 90% of you guys are not subscribed. If you just hit that subscribe button, it means the entire world to me. Thank you so much. We're very close to halfway to 1,000 subscribers. Let's get it. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.